Leave the trading to the pros with AP Social Trading. Invest smart, hassle-free, and enjoy passive income with peace of mind. There is a substantial risk of loss associated with trading Forex, binary options, stocks, or equities, collectively, asset classes. Only risk capital should be used for trading. Trading in any asset classes is not appropriate for everyone. Past performance is not necessarily indicative of future results. No representation is being made that investors will make profits or will not sustain losses. Before trading in any asset classes, investors should consult with their professional broker, financial advisor, or financial consultant to determine whether trading asset classes is appropriate. Investors who trade in any asset classes should only do so if the capital used for this purpose represents funds that an investor can afford to lose without adversely impacting the investor's lifestyle. No trading strategy or methodology is without risk of loss. No trading strategy is risk-free and no trading strategy can guarantee profits or freedom from losses. Investors risk losing the cost to execute any transaction, including associated commissions or fees. You should carefully consider whether trading in any asset class is appropriate for you in light of your investment experience and financial resources. Any trading decisions you make are solely your responsibility and at your own risk. None of the statements or materials in the Ovoria Prime chat rooms constitute a solicitation or recommendation to buy or sell. Welcome everybody to this month uh, inside the Core for Flash. Uh, my name is Dominic and we will go through different settings, different accounts to see uh, how what is going on with Flash and so on. If you have any questions, please uh, put them into the chat or Q&A uh, so I can answer them live. And also, as you know, if you have any questions anytime uh, regarding Flash, uh, just message our support through avoriaprime.com. Uh, you have live chat or use uh, support the dot at avoriaprime.com uh, and you can always reach us and we can always help you. So uh, let's jump into our Flash accounts. Uh, I have one Flash account that I'm running our standard settings. Uh, so first of all, let's take a look at the MyFXBook account. Uh, as you can see here, uh, right now, the Flash account is up 7.51%. So right now, it's doing 2.32% uh, a month. Uh, the drawdown was a little bit bigger because of the big movements of the DXY, the USD pairs, and we are trading uh, only USD pairs that uh, have USD. So as you can see uh, right here, uh, we are trading Euro USD. Euro USD, NZD USD, and AUD USD. Uh, we get here. Uh, yeah, let's jump into the settings so you guys can see what settings I'm running. I'm running standard, uh, standard settings for Flash. Uh, I'm not changing anything. I'm not doing anything manually. Everything is done by Flash, uh, so it's completely automated. Uh, first of all, you can see here uh, we are running Euro USD. We are running NZD USD. We running usd cat and we are also running uh, gbp usd so the settings are for all the pairs are uh, completely the same i didn't change anything so you can see here uh, i'm running a starting lot 0 0.003 uh, so this is like i would say a little bit more aggressive uh, because we have one two three four pairs okay so if we have four pairs that means that our starting lot size is actually uh, 0, 0 0.12 okay 0 0.12 and if we divide this uh, by 5000 because we have 5000 on our account this means that we are running actually let me just see 0 0.12 so we are actually running uh, 0 0.01 uh, for every $500 on the account. So in my opinion, uh, this is aggressive. This is also like why the drawdown was a little bit bigger. Uh, so what you should do, like if you want to be more conservative, you should be running. Uh, if you have, let's say, uh, four pairs and you have $4,000 on the account, you should be running 0 0.01 uh, on every single uh, pair. Why? Because then altogether you have 0 0.04 uh altogether 0 0.04 
what comes out to 0 0.01 per thousand. So if you put 0 0.02 uh, on each account, then you're gonna have 0 0.08 all together. So that we're running actually 0 0.01 per every $500. Uh, so this is like really aggressive. So I would uh, say and suggest that it's better to run 0 0.01 per thousand. So that means if you have $6,000, you can run 0 0.01 uh, 0 0.02 uh, on two accounts. So you get together 0 0.06. Uh, take profit cash amount. I have it set to 1,000 because it's never going to uh, reach it. Uh, then we have trailing stop loss. I have it set to true. Uh, cash trail start. It starts at $21. Uh, so right now uh, I can show you an example because the trailing stop loss just kicked in. Unlock profitability with Flash, your reliable trading companion. Trade confidently, keep more profit, and reclaim your time for what matters. Uh, here on USD Cat, so you can see the total profit. It's uh, twenty-three dollars. So it started the cash trail start started at twenty-one dollars in profit altogether, uh, and then when the profit goes, you see twenty-three point fifty-one. You have to do minus nine. So if the profit is going to go down uh, to 14.5, uh, uh, then it's going to take us out. It's going to take profit and that's it. But if the um, market is going to continue down, we will secure more and more profit as the market continues to go down. So this is how the trailing stop works. Uh, so how do we get to these numbers? You just multiply your starting lot size. Uh, you multiply your starting lot size with... Okay. You just multiply your starting lot size here. You multiply it with 700. 700. And then you will get the uh, when to start trailing. And then to get the uh, cash trail buffer, you multiply your starting lot size. You multiply it with 300. Okay. Multiply it with 300. And you will get the number, the cash trail buffer. It's really easy. Then max open trades prepare. I have it set to 20 because I'm not doing anything manually here. I'm not checking flash. I just check it once a week if everything is connected and that's it. Uh, then max trades pips enabled. I have it set here true and two trades for every 30 pips. Uh, risk management. I have it set uh, to zero. So here it's prepare. So here you should like uh, decide how much you're willing to risk. So if you're willing to risk, I don't know. Uh, let's say 10% per pair. I think this is like a lot. I would go more like with 5%. So 5% 5 from uh, 5,000, it's 250 per pair. So if you lose on all four accounts, then this would be like $1,000. So you would lose 20% of your account. But usually it doesn't happen that it hits take uh, stop loss on all the pairs at the same time. Uh, continue after working after stop loss. I have it set to true. Uh, pending time, uh, how long the uh, <clears throat> the trades, the pending orders stay on the chart. I have it set to 90 minutes. And then I have stoch uh, stochastic indicator overbought at 90 and oversold at 10. Uh, trade on Monday through, uh, Tuesday through, Wednesday through, uh, Thursday through. And then I don't trade on, trade on Friday, but if their trades open uh, to Friday too, then of course it's gonna also trade and manage the trades. Uh, then I have uh, having Monday start at two in the morning and trading till 22. And I have it set for every single day, the exactly uh, same trading times. Uh, and these are the settings for all the pairs. So here with Flash, uh, we just have to give it time. We have like an account that is with us now already, like for what, like over uh, three years. Uh, since flash started uh the account it's doing amazing he is a, in a little bit of a drawdown right now because he was experimenting before with us 30 and he is like in this us 30 trades i think like already for a year and a half so just stick to the pairs that we know they're working but as you can see the total gain is over 600 percent since uh february 20 uh yeah uh, february 27 2022 
So it's going to be almost now like three years since he's, he started Flash. So yeah, the results are amazing. Keep on trading with it. Just stick to the uh, default settings and you will be fine. Let me see if there's like any questions. As I see, there's like no questions. And again, if you have any questions, please reach out to support. Uh, they will be more than happy to help you with everything. Uh, thank you for everyone uh, that uh, joined to this webinar uh, live. And also thank you to everyone that was watching the replay. Uh, I wish you a great uh, training month and talk to you next month. Bye-bye. Thank you.